we believe in ESG. We believe strongly in environment. We believe strongly in social. And we strongly believe in governance. That's an inherent belief given by our parent, inherent belief in India. It's a part of our DNA. Now our journey on ESG is to say not that rank 13 or 12 or 10. It's about what do we do to enable ESG to be a part of the business culture. We, it is embedded totally in the company's strategy. Let me give you some small example. Our parent, our founder, gave away 94% of his wealth to the Robert Bosch Trust. Our belief in societal changes, including in India, was far, far deeper for the size of the company. We are not a Tata and the builders, but for our size of the company, in terms of belief and giving back. That is why Prime Minister Modi talked very fondly of our inauguration, of saying Bosch, when it came, was a German engineering company. Today, it is both German and Indian in spirit and heart. And we share so much information and we do so much with the government. So right. societal matters has to be a belief and a culture and set as a part. And it is. On governance, you'll be happy to know we got the best board governance award from Golden Peacock. And to me, that's an indicator that we believe in corporate governance and get measured for it. In environment, we have very strict environmental rules, sometimes in many cases ahead of statutory norms. We believe in no landfill. Our wastewater treatment for decades have been equivalent to the water intake. There's no pollution levels and so on and so forth across India. So basically, I would say ESG is an integral part. It has to be looked as a part of the business. And in my view, in the mid and long run, it will give companies huge credibility, scores, and aid in business. And we have this deep belief.